How's it going, guys? Welcome to episode three of the Skyrim Let's Play. We are in the middle of the Bleak Falls Barrow, and uh, we just watched this guy die. We just watched the guy die. Yeah. Isn't this the one where there's that guy strung up in the spider web and he runs away? Yeah. That yeah, I game. forget his name, but he's strung up in the spider web. So you guys know how this goes. There's snake, and then the fallen one is another snake, and then dolphin. I don't know yeah. if it's different for every one, but you know this is the first like rudimentary puzzle that you have to do. Now you get to pull the lever. Oh, let's or check out our bandit outlaw. We can search him quick, yeah. I don't really need any of that. There nice. we go. Well, you know, I'm pretty ingenious figuring out. <laughs> I know, they're so easy, right? Almost like, it's almost demeaning. Third like grade puzzles. Of you. Ooh, can you do this? It's pretty tough. We can do that later. We can up our... Oop, I didn't want one more of those. Yeah, um, I like to like sometimes save up the levels and like do them all at once to yeah, get like this is. sort of big cathartic moment where you just get really good out of nowhere. Oh! Where? Oh, they're <laughs> so quick. <laughs> where did it go? Their running is like quicker than your yeah. turning your head. I can like hear, they're like purring. I don't know, what is he even doing? He's just kind of running around you. Snorting. So Thank I get, you, that's why I wake Max up in the my... morning. Yeah, that's how. Hey, Max. <laughs> Weak paralysis poison. Here he comes. <laughs> Oh, there it is! <laughs> Floating at the music cue, and it's like glitching yeah. down you. <laughs> Wounded crossbow strike. Too far back. That's Just wanted nice. a chance to use a little magic. Yeah, it's always good. These are so nasty. I'm like, I feel like I can't move very much. Oh, he's crouched. Oh, I didn't mean to. Alright, I can see my health. I get some potions. Alright, alright. Do I have babies. a healing thing yet? Restoration. Yeah. Get him out of wood. Kill it! <laughs> Kill it! It's been dead for a while. Over Is here. there a baby one? No. You did it. You killed it. Now cut me down before anything else shows up. Where's the golden claw? Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door in the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. Help me down and I'll show you. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Oh, I think I could. Hand over the claw. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. You know he's gonna run, so... So... <laughs> you wanna, like, get, arrow him? I'm or? gonna get ready. Oh, okay, there we go. So let's cut him down. Can you harm him when he's in the it's web? Loose. I, I don't know. I think we can only hit the web, yeah. Get him, get him, get him! You fool. <laughs> oh, what? I, it's not even going to him. That, no, wow. It's, it's like, <laughs> Look at your miss. Pretty cool. What the heck? Huh? I'm already like, that's it's already glitching out. It's cutscene. It was a presumptuous cutscene. Yeah, it was. It really was. All right. Argyll's journal. Find the secret of, of Bleakfell's barrow. Oh, I got some high bracers. What, what am I looking like here? Looking mm. pretty good. Put on the bracers. Arvel the Swift, my favorite oh. Skyrim character. Oh, the looking classic. pretty iron. Okay, there we go. For some reason, I didn't realize that. Okay. Good. Do we get to see our first Draugr? Oh yeah, you always like hit him preemptively. Yeah, here we go. They, yeah, I always do that too. I think there's, there's some kind of tell. I think. 
forget what it is. They look slightly different in some way, and you can tell if they're good. Oh, goodness. They're already surrounding me. All right, let's do this. Finish him off. There we go. All right, gotta heal up. Everyone just like kneels and gives up when they get low health, you know? Yeah. Well, it's not like they have an option. I feel like they're just weakened, right? Yeah, I suppose so. Obviously, I'm not supposed to walk onto that. Do people really, like, give up and, you know, yield and run away after that, though? Because they're always like, no, please, no more. I wonder if you wait it out. Would Sometimes they, actually, they attack yeah. you, yeah. It's so silly. Oh, that's scary. Oh, he's really good. Okay. One. He's tough as hell. I think I'm a little. Uh, you have potions? Out of my pay grade right here. Yeah. I have a good deal of potions. another one. Yep, there is. Just a normal guy. A woman. One down there. Jesus Christ. All right, I need like some stamina potion or something. Do I have a stamina? Yeah, Just you one? Ooh, how nice. Okay. <laughs> Come on, bro. Alright, I'm getting kind of down to the wire there with my health. I probably should like legitimately heal go. now. Oh, there's another one coming. Yeah, I see, I see. Ah, he's got a bow. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the the ancient thing. Nord arrows. Do you use those? I feel like those are the crappy ones. Those are like, yeah. I think you can you can sell them if you get good enough with bartering at some point, right? True. So it's just like. Gold because it doesn't weigh the arrows don't weigh anything in this right. game. So you just kind of Take them as you please mm. We're getting there Just being encumbered I don't want them to flee from combat actually Where oh is that just oh it's a trap. It's the yeah, it's just a trap blades I was running. Uh, you player. gotta sprint through them. I was I was trying to sprint. It oh, wouldn't really? let me sprint. Oh no. We really need to get up. <laughs> controller. Oh my god. All right, we gotta be very careful in this cave, guys. I'm sorry, I know. Oh, the flame jar thing. Yeah, the flame <laughs> jar. I don't want to mess with that right now. There's no need. There's, yeah, nothing happening over there. There we go! Nice. Sigurd in all his Nordic <laughs> might. Oh yeah, we are close to getting encumbered. I didn't even realize. I'm just carrying a bunch of crap, I think. Alright, here we go. Now we can... Yeah, good. I can just use the... my magic, actually. Wake him up for his... Oh. Oh, should I? I didn't... I thought you that would arrow. wake him, him up. Shoot him with an arrow. I will. I thought that would wake him up. So like... No. They sleep soundly. Alright. There it goes. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, it worked! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I didn't know about that. It's more for the sake of just doing it than it's, like, helpful in any way, you know what I mean? Yeah, sometimes it's helpful, but only, <laughs> yeah, it's, like, very specific yeah. circumstances or whatever. Alright, here we go. Oh, here we are. Jeez, the laugh is kind of creepy. Yeah. They remind me of like the undead pirates from Pirates of the Caribbean. Version. They are very much like that. <laughs> I know you're here, puppy. 
Bootstraps, bootstraps, <laughs> bootstraps, bootstraps. Okay. Oh boy. I can do some stuff from here. Maybe I should level up, like right before I die or something. Yeah, just doesn't to get your health go up? Yeah, yeah my, so I can make my health go up if I, if I so choose. They need to break down and give us some straight up pirate content. They like hinted yeah. there are pirates in the world, but there's nothing truly. Oh, nice. There go collarbone shot right there. <laughs> Gross. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty painful looking. I'm not gonna lie. There's one right through his wrist. Yeah, there was no pirate DLC for this, was there? Yeah, there should have been. The vampire one was cool. Yeah. Um. All right, where do I go? Do I follow? Oh, I follow this. Yeah, they should get together with the the guys who did the Assassin's Creed Black Flag like real time naval combat yeah, stuff, that was and sick. like figure out how to do that for Skyrim. That'd be actually really cool. That'd be neat. Get some glowing mushrooms over here. Ooh, what's that place called? Black Reach. Black like Reach with all the glowing yeah. stuff. Man, it'd be cool to be kind of like a potion mixer kind of guy. I've never tried to do that before. I've never gotten really good at like alchemy and stuff. Yeah, alchemy. Yeah. I've I just make a bunch of like weak fatigue potions and minor wounds potions. And like, yeah. And you carry like 50 around. And you're good. Oh, here's a guy. <laughs> Stop oh him in his God. tracks. Something about those is so satisfying though. I mean, they're so goofy, but you're, like you hear the sound and you oh, watch no. them just. Yeah. What was that? I just kicked something oh. off the ledge by mistake. <laughs> it is satisfying, I know. Especially when you hit, like, if you're if you're out just, like, playing around with the archery and you hit a deer in the field from, like, you know, yards and yards away. Yeah. Have you ever done that? Just, like, seeing how far away you can hit a deer? That's the goal, though. Because it, cause it, the cutscene goes, like, full across, yeah, like, It takes, like, the, an hour just yeah. watching the arrow slow motion. <laughs> it's cool, man. It is funny how it gets it wrong sometimes and you miss the shot. Yeah, like earlier. Yeah, yeah. It's so weird. All right. That's about all that's worth anything. Is there a pathway down there or no? I don't think so. All right, which way did we come out from? Here? Um, well, the waypoint, I think, is telling us to go the other way. Maybe. Oh, yeah, you're right. Sorry. These are extensive caves, I forgot how. Yeah, they're pretty elaborate. I feel like there's gonna be something up here. Yeah. This looks like, I'm gonna save right here. Do the size of these caves match the size of like the mountains from the outside, you know? Cause I feel like early in gaming, there'd be like a small little house and you go inside it and it's like a huge house. Yeah, I don't know if it's proportional, that's yeah. a good question. That's a tough thing to get right, I feel it like is. Proportions, especially on this scale. Detected, I get it, I get it. Ooh, that was close. I barely got yeah. my shield up. Ah, the top, man. Remember about those potions you got? Oh, right, right, right. Right. I should... I'm trying to get like two slices in. I think I can really only get. I forget, I'm supposed to bash in between their strikes. Okay, then. Like, that's... The, their opening? Yeah, that's the opening to bash. Apprentice. All right. Oh, that didn't give you any warning. No, well, I, this is a lock pick I used earlier that oh. I sort of... Weakened. I love how the, the lockpicks like get super skinny right at the neck, so it's like they're built to break. Nice. Got it. Yeah. All right. This is worth 18 gold. I can buy back the lockpicks for that. Yeah, we're going on the using the claw, right? Yeah, we are.
Ooh, ooh scary. More of this crap. All right, I'm gonna actually sprint this time, all right? Let's see. Oh. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> little slice. Oh. It All these guys like are waking up. It like it was a delayed up. reaction. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm having trouble with this controller. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, man. Oh man. Oh, use the fire. Ah, uh, maybe. <laughs> Oh, you're leveling up so quick in different areas. I guess that's because you're still new, like level three or whatever. Yeah, it's it's going up. Nice. Oh shoot, where are you? He's oh, he shot me with yeah. an arrow. That's why. Ah, yeah. That's Whoa. the ticket right there. <laughs> so quick, <laughs> scary. All right, oy vey. I never know what I miss. I'm just gonna keep plugging along. Yeah, it's okay. Some of the coolest, the coolest kind of cave is the Dwemer cave. Because you get the sense that things are still operating and like working. It's just like a race of mechanical yeah. engineers. And yeah, they, they took such pride in, in their architecture. Um, it's in miscellaneous, I think. Golden Claw. So, how do you zoom the right click, stick? Click the right, yeah. So, bear. Bear, mosquito, or dragonfly. And dragonfly owl. and owl. You can tell we've been dealing with mosquitoes. <laughs> all mosquitoes all in there. summer long. Last one? Owl. Okay. What do you guys think about this puzzle aspect of the game? Because I don't know. It, it seems it seems almost oversimplified. You know, they, it is oversimplified. They could have made it a little more interesting. The answer is on the back of the, <laughs> yeah. the key. It's something you do like it's like a kindergartner's assignment. You know? Yeah, it is. I know. Match the symbols, match the colors. <laughs> a little bit. Um, Condescending. Yeah. <laughs> put the put the square peg in the square hole kind of thing. Right. Yeah. Exactly. It's it's literally that. Oh, man. I guess their it's their first uh, try with puzzles though in any kind in any form. Yeah. This is beautiful. This is a cool. Section. This is when you know there's gonna be like a boss fight or whatever. Yeah. The first. Uh, I forget what those stone things are called that gives you the shouts. Yeah. The, sh the shout wall, I think. Yeah. I love the eerie, off in the distance the music is playing. Oh! <laughs> it's so sad, you're just like swiping at them as they're slowly getting out of bed. <laughs> He's about to boost Rodami. Uh oh. Ah, shoot, wow, that was very delayed. Yeah, that was very delayed. Do I have any stamina watch stuff? He says watch off. Yeah, he does. Ah, shoot, I'm gonna level up. <laughs> All right, stamina, yes, please, and then health. All right, I'll, I'll oh. save the perks. I leveled up again. Wow, that's, that's kind of nice. I yeah, saved them and nice. I just get them. I just replaced my own. They roll over. Nice. Woo! Goodness me. Don't go away yet. The dragon's There's so much stone. like happening at once. You just be defeated a boss, you level up, you. <laughs> yeah, sensory open. Yeah, it. really. Uh, okay, I don't need that. Ancient Nord Sold of. I'll get plenty of things to. Cold things to disenchant <laughs> later to learn that spell. <laughs> Do you guys know how that works? All right, garnet gold lock fit, potion of the defender. I, I, I may use that. I probably won't. This is the beginning of it. This is the beginning of my. I may use that potion in the future thing, <laughs> where I stock up on useless potions and I only use healing potions. Yeah. That might be useful to disenchant. 
It'll be cool. Yeah, and then, I don't know. Like, halfway through the game, you finally just sell all the potions or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm, I'm picking up <laughs> potions right now I know that I'm not going to use. Yeah. All right. But you got to get them. They're there. They're, you know, they're they're purple and they're worth yeah. something. <laughs> they're purple and they're pretty. <laughs> they look like they're worth something, yeah. And I think in, in some interview, Todd Howard says that the core of all these games are just like looting games. You know, you go through a place and you get all right. the stuff that you know is worth something. <laughs> they are looting games. They are. That's a very good way to put it. Oh, that's a cool, like, shrine. I kind of don't want to mess yeah. that up. Seems sacred in a way. Ah, the freshly cleared cave feeling when it yeah. gives you, rewards you with the beautiful view. This version of the game definitely feels more colorful and brighter. This is definitely more welcoming. I like it. It is welcoming. All right, well, should I discover anything that's nearby me right now? Like, down here? Yeah, before I go back? To. I'm supposed to return to the the ungrateful Fire, uh, court wizard. Yeah. I see you dabble in the arts. His voice is so weird. I can't even do it. His voice is so... Yeah, I know. I don't have a pickaxe, right? The slow pickaxe animation I always hated that. Oh yeah, I know. Oh man. I don't, I don't really know. Probably nothing of use. There's a cave that's like right by me here. You gotta jump up the mountain. Yeah, well I, I think it's I'm coming around to it. There we go. Oh man. <laughs> very, very eventually. Here we go. There. Ooh. That's I'm satisfied with that. It's nice to have a bunch of uh, found places that you haven't pillaged yet, because then when you need to like level up real quick, you can hit them all. Yeah. I've done that before. Or if you get um, if you get a quest marker to go there, and you've never even entered it before, and you can just fast travel yeah, immediately yeah. there. You don't have to schlep yourself all the way there on foot. Put that nasty I fire. Be with petty thievery and drug <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Shush. You see, the terminology is clearly first era or even earlier. Oh, clearly. Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. Seems you are a cut above the usual brutes the Jarl sends my way. You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Okay, thank you, Ferengar. My associate here will be pleased to see your handiwork. She Is discovered its location yeah. by means she has so far declined to share with you. His so mutton chops. information was correct yeah. after all. And we have our friend here to thank for recovering it for us. You went into Bleak Falls Barrow and got that? Yeah. Nice work. <laughs> Just send me a copy when you've deciphered it. All right. Ranga, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. You should come too. Really? A dragon? How exciting. <laughs> Where was it seen? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. Let's go. So why is she going up here? To get the dude. Oh, yeah. He's chilling in the middle of this. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? <laughs> yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. All right. Irla, there's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than I anyone do. else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. You like this, Emmett? <laughs> it's so long with this, it's crazy. I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted you think to purchase the conversation property like, in the city. There's a dragon, oh shit, let's please. go. I know. You know? I can purchase property in the city. 
All right. Already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Okay. Good. Let's go. Don't fail me. Help I'll see you in the wash dragon before the rest. All right, let's go. <laughs> I know you guys like to Wait, talk. Wait, one more thing before we go. I wanted to tell you <laughs> that my assistant wants you to go back to Bleak Falls Barrow <laughs> to make sure you get all the purple mountain flower on the shrine. <laughs> God. I need them for an arrangement for my daughter's wedding. It's very important. <laughs> Maybe ride the dragon back. It's like it gets convoluted. Yeah, and... yeah. <laughs> right, come on, Irolath. Come on. Host oh, haste. I'm coming. Please wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ashman! Oh, Ashman! The chat Ashman. Thanks, girl. Those green apples you sold me the other day were delicious. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh no! There's still audio. Let's wait it out. Okay. <laughs> Moments like that when I haven't saved in a while are just terrifying. They had to load the conversation about the green apples. It was yeah, very I know. important. Where's our girl? I don't know. Forget Let's it. just. Can I just go? Yeah. And it won't like mess up the quest or anything? Nah, I think you can just go. Like an awkward distance away. Yeah, just far enough to be like in the wilderness, <laughs> away from the castle. Catch my first peep of a dragon that I'm gonna fight here. You absorb the power of the dragon? Is that it on the ground? No. I think we gotta wait for someone to say something. Yeah, what's up? Who is this is where I'm supposed to wait. Some scared soldier? Maybe? No, nothing. Nothing. Wow, we gotta wait for Aerolith. Aerolith! <sighs> okay, I'm not sure what's going on. Level up available. <laughs> Where's the dragon? Aerolith. Oh, I hear it. I hear it too, yeah. Oh, oh there it is. is. So yeah, hopefully we can just fight it without her. I completed meet Aerolith in the Northwestern Watchtower. <laughs> Mir Mulnir. I don't remember it having that name. All right, it's gonna. You can tell when it's when it's going down to. Shoot, that was horrible. Nice. And yeah. I don't know, you, you can just kind of tell the difference between like landing on the ground and landing in the air. Yeah. Yeah, it's like memorizes some pretty animations. Yeah, oh, okay. Animations. Ah, I got it up there. Nice. I'm really bad shooting arrows at the dragon, it's terrible. Yeah, like you said, memorizing the animations is helpful. They're a little choppy like that. They you know, are, so yeah. Can be kind of hard to follow. They like auto correct when they get too close to the ground. Yeah. Shoot, that was awful. His own blood. Is that his blood or is that? Uh, I'm not. I'm never sure. They always get yeah. like that though. All right, I should probably run away. <laughs> God. Yeah. You wow. See? I'm like the only one left, aren't I? Yeah, I think so. The guards always die quick. Yeah. All right. Bro, I'm getting in the tower. Ah. <laughs> All right, let's. Yeah. Woo! Fireball. No, oh, shoot! Man, scary. Yeah. Right on me. Oh, goodness. Yeah. Ah. Is that firing guard shooting the sparks? That? What was oh. that? <laughs> he just shot the dude. Do you know what that was? That. Yeah. I don't know what that was. I don't remember that from this game. Hey! Nice. <laughs> oh, All right, here I go, absorbing the soul nice. of the dragon. 
Yes. Yes! The soul! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> it's my own little Michael Bay cinematic edit for that part. <laughs> oh, get his bones, you're gonna be super over encumbered now. Alright. Wow, a real dragon. I can't believe it. Zero okay. dragon souls. It didn't count for one. Oh, there it goes. I can't believe Ooh. it. You're dragonborn. <laughs> in the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. Try to According shout. To old legends, only the dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? Boosh! That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the dragonborn. <coughs> Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of so Tiber Septim okay. killing any I think dragons. I'm good. Uh... Did you gotta talk to the Dark Elf Lady? Yeah, but I think I'm gonna save that for the next episode. Cool, yeah. So you guys, thank you. I hope you're enjoying this little series. He's kind of like this, like a superhero. He's got these superpowers. Yeah, he is like a superhero. It's, cool. it's like a superhero origin story. Yeah, it really is. Medieval superhero. I like it. Tell us, do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Well, we just saw me shout, so I think it's pretty safe to say. Dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now you understand you know a dead dragon. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> cool, guys. Uh, well, thank you, and we'll see you uh, next week. Take care. I'm getting out of here. Oh. <laughs>